What if I told you that right now I have with me a build that every Shadow Priest would love? On stream I got to play some Shadow Priest and I saw just how much melee wreck you. So glad to know that didn't change with the specialization at all. But one thing I did notice is there was a build designed by one man so then you never have to cast. You think it's clickbait, but I'm gonna show you what this build is all about. Now, I should show you the build, but I'm not going to. Now, before you call this video clickbait and hit the dislike button, I didn't want to be disingenuous. This isn't my build to show, but I do want to give the credit to the hardworking man and Bonnie, Shadow Priest on EU, Gladiator, the man who came up with this build. So please do support whatever amount of wild YouTubers we do have left on YouTube by checking out his video to learn the build. Thank you so much for the message and enjoy the rest of the video. This is a very fun build, don't get me wrong. So what I'm gonna do is insta-cast all day. I'm not gonna cast, if I have to cast, I'm losing. If I ever at any point have to cast, I'm not doing it right. If I'm not insta-casting, then I'm doing it wrong. So, insta-cast the whole time. Don't even think about normal casting. I'm gonna clean this guy off Berserk for as much as I can. If you are casting for any reason, you're doing it wrong. Understand this. Alrighty, so here we go. Insta-casting. Insta casting. I got my burst up again. I'm redotting. I am hitting. Redotting. Can silence, but I am hitting. I am hitting with everything I got. Redotting the whole team. Let's just redot them all. I probably shouldn't be using my uh, void bolt when I can't redot them. And the only time you ever want to cast is your artifact weapon, so you can hold off on that uh, that amazing damage for a little longer. That's the only reason why you would want to do that. Okay, I need to redot this guy. You're gonna stun him here. I'm gonna keep running so we can dot up these guys. Dot this guy up, dot this guy up, silence him. Not casting, not casting, not casting a thing. If we have to cast, we lose. Understand this, this is the build. If we cast, we lose. That is part of the game. Don't play this game where you have to cast. Never cast again with this build right now. Understand this? If you are casting, you are doing it wrong. Look at this. I could have casted, but I'm not going to. I'm going to just instant cast everything. Dotted, dotting. I can cast. I can cast into this guy, but I'm not going to. Guess why? Because I'm playing this build. I'm going to put a stun on him, but into his low, bam, insta-cast, insta-cast. If you are not insta-casting, you are not doing this right. Uh, we're actually going to pop the uh, the heal reduction from the pet, and we're going to hit the mage for a little bit. No mind, can't cast, don't cast. We dot up, refresh dots, uh, take, off, take off all the buffs, all the buffs are taken off. Now I'm just kind of waiting for my stuff to be back up off of cooldown, but that's it. Uh, I got a... I got an ability, I got a setup going, not casting. I can cast, I should hold it. Actually, yes I can, with my artifact weapon. But this, cause only reason is because this is a fucking tank. I even want to silence him. I really, really want to silence him. But I know I shouldn't, cause that'll be a waste of time. <laughs> my god, he's still alive. Are you kidding me? I'm silencing him, fuck it. I'm silencing this fucker. <laughs> he's a tank, we can't beat him. <laughs> what I'm doing part of this build is not only dotting, but I'm also cleaving things. I'm dotting, I'm cleaving, I'm always on the move, I'm never casting, I can never be interrupted, I always have my abilities set up. Uh, this is, I don't have any weaknesses. Unless a melee will a train on me, like always. But that's always been a weakness for Priest, I feel like. Here we go. I'm gonna stun this guy. He might stun both of them. No, he did not. But it's okay, because we still have our burst. And we have an insta cast. And we continue on our thing. Just hitting him. Insta cast. Still have insta. Insta cast and still. Redotting. Redotting. I probably should have dispersed. I could have dispersed that actually. We're gonna silence the healer. Uh, and continue on the dots. Never cast. Always be on one run. So if you ever decide to cast an ability, because you're running, it won't let you do anything. So never cast again. Never, never have to cast again with this wonderful new build. It's almost like I'm Billy Mays or something. Billy Mays here with a wonderful new build. Never having to cast. Never having to stop moving. Never having to do anything differently. Just keep dotting the world. That's all you need to do. Just dot them all. I could cast. I could cast. Or I could wait for my instant. And then score and finish off. That's all you do in this build. And look at this damage. Oh! Oh! It's pretty good. We are losing this BG, but I'm not here to win a BG. I'm just here to insta-cast and uh, get up damage. I don't care for uh, getting actual uh, wins in a BG. Not today, man. All right, I got a bunch of people insta-cast here. We're probably going to go on this uh, red pally. Fuck it, why not, right? I'm so bad at dot management when it comes to running around and moving around. So I'm just trying my best here. No insta-cast procs, which is a little bit, uh, makes me a little bit sad here. 
I think they're getting cleansed. I think they're actually cleansing. Oh, there's two monks, that's why. They both have that uh, thing that, uh, that they can cleanse instacast. Or they can cleanse all my dots with that uh, big heal, whatever the hell they have. Nice, we got big damage here. We're gonna pop uh, Siphon on him so he can heal. Then we're gonna continue dotting him up. Continue dotting. Yep, continue cleaving. Cleave central. Cleave city. Never stop cleaving. We never stop the cleaving. We were already cleaving when the cleave was cleaving and we never stopped the cleaving. Insta cast, keep on running. This guy once with us, must be away from us. We're gonna pop away all of his abilities and we're gonna keep on running and I think we're actually gonna die here maybe? Uh, now we really need to cast something on us. Uh, oh yeah, nothing, that's why. We are playing this no cast build. We should cast nothing. Let's hit him with our artifact weapon. We don't even cast it, you channel it. So technically, by the use of clever English language, I'm not even casting here. I am channeling. Channeling my rage into him. Channeling my laziness into the guy. I don't need to cast. I'm not a caster. I'm an insta-caster. Cast? Not for me, no thank you, my good, kind sir. Haha, <laughs> you thought I needed to cast a spell that summon plebs do. No thank you. This guy can get hit by Delirium. His name is Delirium, I like it, I like it. Get him very, 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 very low on health. And kill him with all insta-cast in one channel. It's all good. And we're doing wonderful. We'll see our damage at the very end. I'm thinking about 100 million. Easy, 100 million. And I can look at this guy and say, I'm sorry. Here's a bubble. <laughs> I feel like an asshole, cause, but it's not like I'm doing this on purpose. Okay, I can't cast that. I would take off the bubble, but again, my no cast policy is still in effect. Now I can cast. I look, I feel like an asshole, because I probably could have saved his life. But I have a strict policy of no casting today. This is just not on my, uh, not on my repertoire. Also, I need to be in a place where there's a lot more alliance here. And I know where they're all at. What? We're gonna dispel that, dispel that, dispel this, uh, probably disperse this, all insta-cast, it's all good. We don't need to be casting anything. You know what, I might just do one cast, I might just do one cast. Oh, no, I don't need to. <laughs> I was gonna mind control the guy off, but he decided to fall off himself, so that's not my fault. I didn't do this. So, yeah. Easy 100 million. What I do, I jumped around like an idiot and dotted things up. So, if you wanna check out this bursty ass, high damage, very mobile, melee, not really a big issue, massive cleave damage with psychic link, mind blast, shadow ward pain, cleave the whole team, mass AoE build. Slash two target build, slash, you know, maybe one target build, never having to cast, never having to worry about interrupts kind of playstyle. Then you might want to check out this build <laughs> by our great Lord and Bonnie. If you're interested in this build, please go check out his channel. So then you might be able to figure out exactly what he does for his build, but it's not like he actually made it like revealed or anything. But hey, never have to worry about melee again as a shadow beast, unless they still train you to the ground, and then there's not a lot you can do about it. But at least they can't interrupt you. That's nice, I guess. <laughs>